it has been a really long time before people recognize me. You gotta push yourself to say fuck what people think and what they expect and what they think of you. Like just be the person you want to be. I see niggas is teaming, but they really is ghost. Yeah, they scheming bite your product, but they calling you broke. I go by the name of Shaka Shams. I'm from Antwerp. Uh, I've been making music since I'm 11. For a while now, I'm 22. So it's been 11 years, damn. Back in the days, there was a like this dope ass event called Freestyle O. It was this dope ass place. That was the first time I really got to know Brussels, and that was really chill and really dope. Cause you had like all elements of hip hop in one place. You had rappers, dancers and all that shit, DJs. Just everything was there. So that's how I got to discover Brussels and the hip hop scene in Brussels thanks to that event. Music has always like kind of been in my family. My granddad was like, uh, he used to play saxophone and do a lot of music stuff. I was 11 years old with my cousin in England. He was making music. And I was like, hey man, I want to rap. And he was like, do that shit. And I was like, hell yeah, I'm gonna do that shit. And then I just did it. <laughs> People did not fully take me seriously, especially when you're young, when you're 11, in, in school in Belgium, where the most people don't even, they only know the music that's on TV. So I had a lot of other influences. I knew who Erica Badu was. My first hip hop concert was when I was eight, was Nas. So I had a completely different music input. And yeah, when, at the beginning it's like, people don't take you seriously. They'll compare you with 50 Cent or anybody who they just know. I did have like a hard time trying to find a musical family and trying to be, you know, like, oh, you look at groups and then you see, you see everybody has their musical family and they have their cliques and I don't, I don't really have a clique. And I really was looking for that validation, but after a while, you just grow on your own and then you're like, fuck that shit, man. I'm, I'm happy on my own. I'm gonna just do my own shit. And I grew on my own and then I got my, then you know, you get siblings instead of a click. My siblings will be blue. She's not blood sibling, but to me, she's a sibling because I'm real close to her. And then a blood sibling would be, for example, Akuma, even though we went two separate ways, it's still a blood sibling. So, you know, there's always going to be people that are going to hate on you, whether it's in your face or not in your face. You just gotta do your thing because you're gonna die anyway, you know? <laughs> so just live your life. <laughs> I'm happy it went the way it went because it made me who I am to not, to, like, not finding the right group and just not having that family from day one made me who I am and made me a bit like this calm but assertive as fuck person, you know? First I wasn't even seen as a threat And still I started rapping like I was rapping my last breath I rap about killing people Even though I don't kill people I rap about love I rap about being black I rap about anything, just life For me it's just a translation of What I live, go through I think everybody goes through a dark time And I think whatever you do in life You gotta be able to translate that in a way Cause if it wasn't for music I don't know what I'll be doing right now, you know? I mean, I do know, but I don't. I know I'll be making money, but I don't know how. <laughs> I'm not a person that talks a lot when it comes to shit, traumas or anything. Let's be real, life isn't only, you know, ha 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 and all good things, nah. Life is also shit. My, my situation is weird financially always. Like, for example, now um, I don't have a heating home. I don't have warm water, but I'm not gonna, I put that in my raps and the mic come out later when I do have warm water. But these are just things to show you that like I go through shit as well. But you know, you just gotta deal with it because it's life. So yeah, I just translated in my music and the moment that I got a big ass crib, I'm gonna translate it into my music as well. And I'm, I think the best thing is just balance because I, I find you, you're allowed to be braggadocious, you're allowed to rap about anything you want, just find the balance and know where you are in your life. If you're gonna go 1,100% from music, go for it. <laughs> don't let nobody stop you. Even if you're 10 years old, don't let nobody stop you.
leave him hanging by the neck Cause they creeping on us, they know the impact of the pack When it's bleeding and they're hungry, so attack Given that, they be honest cause my color's still intact Cut the I've always seen that they do us wrong With my people, I feel that it's been too long As the sequel prevails, I grow on my own I see evil from hell, so it shall be gone I know, I know, I got my own shit to solve But the rebel in me is growing 